Autonomous drones like Ingenuity could become aerial scouts for future astronauts exploring hills, ice caps, and basins that are inaccessible to rovers. Perseverance snapped this image of the distant rim of Jezero crater. Ingenuity reached Mars on the underside of Perseverance, which landed on the Red Planet on February 18th. After establishing contact with the controllers back on Earth, Ingenuity unfolded its carbon fiber legs and dropped from the rover to stand on its own. Perseverance took this selfie with Ingenuity on April 6th. Once mission controllers on Earth are ready for the drone's first flight, Perseverance will receive and relay the final flight instructions to Ingenuity. Small and ultra lightweight, Ingenuity has solar cells positioned atop a pair of carbon fiber rotor blades that spin in opposite directions. The rotor blades spin at 2400 revolutions per minute to generate the lift. Ingenuity needs to fly in the thin Martian air, which is about 1% as dense as the air on Earth. Ingenuity is powered by six lithium ion batteries that are recharged daily by the solar cells. Much of the power is used to run heaters that keep the drone from freezing during the Martian night, when temperature can drop to minus 130 degrees Fahrenheit. Ingenuity will lift off from a makeshift helipad chosen for its flatness and lack of obstructions. On its first flight, the drone will climb to a height of 10 feet, hover for 30 seconds and then land. Up to five flights are planned for the month ahead. News of Ingenuity's first flight will reach Earth via NASA's Deep Space Network, an international array of gigantic radio antennas. The antenna shown here is located in Spain. It may take eight hours before mission engineers learn of Ingenuity's success or failure. In homage to the Wright brothers, Ingenuity carries under its solar panels a piece of fabric from the Wright Flyer airplane which made the first powered flight on Earth in 1903.